the guest house at Graceland, a resort just steps away from the legendary performer's iconic Memphis mansion, visited by some 600,000 fans each year. And now as a three-decade dream becomes a reality, those fans will have a chance to experience a modern take on his larger-than-life style with the help of Priscilla Presley, who had a hand in the design process. You're going to give me a personal tour? I am. Come on, I have so much to show you. Okay, great, let's do it. So this is a replica of the staircase in Graceland. This is a grand staircase. It sure yes. is. Yes, it's a replica of the staircase in the front room as you enter Graceland. The chandelier here is an even larger replica of the same chandelier that's uh, overlooking the, the foyer as well. The sprawling 450-room resort features 20 Elvis-themed suites, all fit for a key and located on the hotel's exclusive top floor, known as the Upstairs, an area resembling Elvis's private living quarters at Graceland, which no one but family and close friends have ever seen. So this is the suite you're staying in, the King yes, Suite? Yes, the King Suite, that's right. And, and this is the and way that Elvis's room looks in Graceland? It's red, yes, red, black, and gold. And if you'll notice, up on the top here of the canopy, we have a television set, as you can see it yes. from here. Um, actually, at Graceland in the master bedroom, we had two. Well, I hope you were watching the Today Show. On the yeah, we'll watch the Today Show. <laughs> I, well, we were never up that early. <laughs> we came home at that time. Another suite inspired by the living room at Graceland, where the Presleys would entertain close friends. He'd play the piano, or sometimes he'd take the guitar, and the guys would join in singing and harmonize with him. I actually see my parents sitting here, my brother, my sister, him, myself, uh, his father. It was like, just kind of this whole thing was sprawled all over the couch. So oh, it was- so it brings back great memories. Yeah, it does. Other amenities of the guest house, a 464-seat theater, and five restaurants serving up Southern comfort food. Where do you feel his presence the most in this whole place? Graceland is where yeah. I really feel the presence. Yeah. I mean, the, his spirit is there. Uh, where I feel it here is just the style and design of what he loved. The guest house at Graceland, where Elvis never leaves the building. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, that was such in. a bad thing, but now I'm with the lovely Priscilla Presley. Thank you for having us here. We've made our way to the lobby. And yes. Elvis is in all of the details of this magnificent property, isn't that right? Absolutely. I mean, if you look around, even at the, the details of the couch, I mean, it's not just a plain couch. There's a little detail of uh, purple that comes in with studs going around. Mm -hmm. I mean, he was such a, he, he, he loved detail. Mm -hmm. And he, he was so stylish himself. I mean, when you look at the way he dressed, even from the time he started out in the early 50s, I mean, he, everyone, you know, looked at him and he goes, my God, who is this? But he, he really, he had just such a flair. And, and actually, this is really what this is all about, mm -hmm. is flair, it's taste, it's beautiful, it's comfortable. I mean, all this, Every, everywhere you look, I mean, it's Elvis is here. In yeah. fact, uh, a couple of people who are friends of mine who, who um, actually was in the inner circle came mm -hmm. in and looked at it and said, oh my God, Elvis is everywhere. And when you see, and, and if you knew him, yeah. you would see even the designs of the chair. He, he, you know, he was way ahead of his time yeah. if you go to Graceland. So let's look at this amazing ceiling. It actually mirrors his jumpsuit. Is that right? Well, it's taken from a cape yeah. that was white with clear crystal. Yeah. And, you know, he, he was a showman. And and people, he did it the first time in Vegas when he brought out this cape, mm -hmm. and he just kind of walked around, and people went crazy with it because mm -hmm. he, he was, like I said, a showman. So this cape was all white with little white crystal in it. it it's, uh, it's just a, a subtle inspiration of, of that particular cape, if you could say subtle. But at night it looks <laughs> yes, so Mac, beautiful. Yes, it's so lit up. Yeah. <laughs> so you have eight-year-old grandbabies. What do you yes. tell them about their granddaddy? Oh my gosh, they know very a lot about. They, they listen to Sirius Radio <laughs> and they put you the know, Elvis uh, Channel, of yes, course. The Elvis Channel, and um, they oh, they ask questions about him, and mm -hmm. they uh, they they just. Um, they're very proud of him, very proud of him. And I can tell you are too. Well, I'm, I'm really proud of this place. I just think this is 30 years in the making, mm -hmm. really, as far as planning, wanting to do this. Uh, we've had three other people who have tried to come up with something mm -hmm. that they felt, but this, this we've got it. it right. We have local designers, uh, mm -hmm. 
uh, that we've been working with, and um, and I've been working very closely with them. Mm -hmm. So, well, thank you so thank you. much. This thank was you. such an honor to be down here. Uh, and by the way, the cheese biscuits were fantastic. <laughs> we have great food here. Yeah, y'all yes. need to come visit. I'm bringing you a mug. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah. Bring a cheese biscuit. Yeah. Uh, Jenna, thank I'll bring you. Bring a cheese biscuit in my bag. <laughs> thank you, Priscilla. Thank you as well. Hello, today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there, and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.